morning again everybody Thursday December 15th um, need coffee we're gonna do stuff oh and in a funny coincidence yesterday since I made the new cutting board coincidentally this morning our old cutting board made by Caroline's uncle bit the dust uh, I'm gonna have to re-glue it and fix it but isn't that weird I made one broke one let's start today this kind of night is... We got a Christmas card from Grandpa and Grandma. Every year, yeah, every year, Grandpa paints a new watercolor painting and then makes Christmas cards out of it. So, Merry Christmas, Grandma and Grandpa. Guys, I've been doing this for 10, 15 years now. 10? At least 10. At least 10. Merry Christmas, Grandpa. I'm gonna go grab lunch with my dad and uh, go brainstorm at his house because we've got a project over there this weekend. A big project. Streets and the sidewalks. I can't remember a quieter city That's right, you guessed it. No, you didn't guess it. Why would you have guessed it? There's no reason for you to have guessed that we are about to refinish most of the first floor of my parents' hardwood floors. Here's to a fun weekend. Damage caused by kids. I can neither confirm nor deny. Yes. Caroline can say whatever she wants, man. I love me some Don Julitos. Chairs. Chairs? Yeah. <laughs> always get a booth. <laughs> Gotta get in the booth, man. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> anyway, Don's was good. Leaving Dad's house now. Had a good lunch with him. Had some Don Chilitos, Sopa Pias. Love those things. Um, going to get some power steering fluid right now. Then going back home. Um, get back to work. This afternoon, we're gonna repair that headboard that broke this morning. First, I have to clean up the rough edges, get all the glue off of there, get a nice clean gluing surface. Now, I take the clean surfaces, glue them together, clamp it, let it dry, hope we're good. Let that dry, re-sand it, re-oil it. I think we saved it. Today is finals week. And for those of you who A, don't go to school, and B, aren't in a relationship with a teacher, and C, aren't a teacher yourself, you may not remember that that week sucks. It either means A, you're taking finals, and that means you're a student and whatever. I'm here to talk about my wife, the adjunct professor. Finals week is a terrible barrage of work and deadlines and pressure and questions and issues that comes into every teacher's life. A little bit of advice to every student out there, just to help yourself and really to help your teacher. Read your syllabus. Don't email your teacher with every single question. If you think to yourself, is this a question I should really be asking? The answer is no. No. And one more important thing to remember, you're a student. Inherently, you don't know anything. So take it easy on your teacher. That concludes our finals week rant. Well, okay guys, uh, that's it for the day. Tomorrow we start the project at my parents' house. So, see you then.